the astronauts return home national heroes. The successful landing was broadcast live on state television. They appear to have opened the door of the landing capsule unaided, looking remarkably relaxed after 30 days orbiting Earth. They landed in the barren wilderness of Inner Mongolia. Hours earlier, the pair were shown completing their final day's work. Their exploits have been dominating the news in China, presenting the ruling Communist Party with a propaganda triumph. Videos of life on board the space laboratory, the Tiangong-2, have been watched more than a hundred million times online. The space duo have set a new Chinese record for the longest mission in space so far. They spent much of the past month conducting experiments, including testing silkworm larvae to see how it changes in a weightless environment. Advancing China's space program is a priority for the Chinese leadership. President Xi Jinping has called for China to establish itself as a space power, while insisting the space program is for peaceful purposes. While China is making advances, analysts say it's still playing catch-up with the United States and Russia. Adrian Brown, Al Jazeera.